All right, so in 1921, they produced over 85 million of the 1921 combined with the 1921D and 1921S mint mark Morgan dollar. So all three of those combined, they produced over 85 million. So they produced a lot of those coins. All right, so first off here, we have an extremely high graded version of the 1921 Denver minted Morgan dollar. Now these dollar coins are extremely, extremely valuable because of their high grades. So this is like almost a perfect grade. The coin grading scale only goes up to 70. This is mint state 67 and this coin sold for over $27,000. All right, so next up is another 1921 Denver minted Morgan dollar. This one here, it's got some nice toning to it. It's graded at a mint state 67 and it's sold for over $44,000. Now keep in mind guys, if you guys do have a 1921 Morgan dollar and it's all scratched up and beat up and it's worn down, it's not gonna sell for these prices, but let's look at some other stuff that can make it even more valuable. All right, so this next one is interesting and weird. It's uh, pretty sweet though. So if we zoom in there to the front of the coin, you can see that it has an engraving. And what that is on this 1921D is that it was the third coin released from the first 100 coins at the Denver Mint. So that is extremely, extremely rare. This coin here sold for over $13,000. Moving right along to a 1921S. Keep in mind, this is a very high graded coin as well, mint state 67. That's what gives it a lot of value. And this coin here sold for over $19,000. Now, moving right along to a 1921S that has a thorn head. So we're gonna look at what exactly that is. This is graded here at about uncirculated 53, so it's not a mint state grade, so a little lower, but it's still sold for thousands of dollars. And there are a ton of different VAMs of these coins. I'm not gonna go into all that because we would be here all day if we went through all the 1921 VAMs. So here is an example of the thorn head that takes place on this 1921 Morgan dollar. So what that is, is that that is a die gouge. Now this coin, because of that die gouge, that thorn head on this coin, it sold for over $7,000. Moving right along, here's a 1921S. It's graded at an AU50, about uncirculated 50, so even a lower grade. Now this also has the thorn head. You can see it's not in as great as condition as the other ones and it's sold for a little over $300. So you go from thousands of dollars to 300 really quick. All that depends, especially on the grade of the coin. All right guys, until tomorrow, I'll see you on the comment section below. This is Couch Collectibles and this is where I disappear.